I just got a shark. Oh, he came off. Good. Oh. 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 Whoa, Daddy Rabbit. He got it now. <laughs> Love God, tell me about that. <laughs> What do you think, Walter? Woke up this morning. Our back deck is completely enclosed in snow as we get ready to head to Florida. Good time to leave and good time to get down to West Palm. We're going to be fishing with Sam Heaton. Most importantly, we're going to be getting out of this weather. This is crazy. Let's get out of Kansas quick. Ready to go. <laughs> we're gonna try. We're gonna pick up some bait. We're gonna try some snook, maybe for a little bit. And some Spanish. Get the fish in this boat. All right, all right. Woo, Sam Heaton. I didn't expect you in anything but the best. Well, you know, I've been with Ranger for 18 years, and you know, between Forest Woods, Nina Woods, Randy Hopper. They believed in coming to market with a quality product and customer service. And that's what I believe in. And I'm just very fortunate to still be in a ranger. And this boat looks like it's gonna handle us great out on the inland and out on the offshore fishing. I right? hope we sink it with fish. Yeah! <laughs> what is the limit on these fish? Well, on, uh, on Spanish it's eight per person. Okay. And on the snook, it's one per person. Okay, great, great. You think we'll catch those? Oh yeah, I think we'll catch some. All right, all right. Sam Heaton, I'm getting excited, buddy. All right. All right let's do it. Nate, check that. We're probably one of the first people in America to see the sunrise, isn't that cool? Yeah. Because this is as far east as America goes. Yeah, this is about as far east as America goes. I don't know who that is. It did. Papa was up $10 a pound. Catch him, catch him, catch him. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that? Weather. Weather's been bad. You know, a lot of wind. We're getting a lot of south wind right now. I don't know. We might not be able to get on the beach. The reason I'm picking up some live bait from the snook. We've got an incoming tide. People say, well, how you know it's an incoming tide? What you do, you take one of them signs right there? Yeah. And you look at those pilots. <laughs> Oh, yeah. It's very scientific. It's coming in, Mark. Yeah. I see it's that. Very scientific. So, Sam, what are we doing here? We're buying some bait. Buying some bait. Yeah, these guys are driving all the way to Miami to catch this bait. There's no bait up here right now. Yeah. And uh, so, the snook fishing is... I mean, you can catch them on artificial, no question about it. Yeah. But you can't, they don't hit artificial as well as they do live bait. What kind of bait are we talking? We're talking about pilchards about like that. 
So all these boats right here are just circling to get up there and get bait from that no, guy. No, the boat behind us is a good line to get bait. These guys, that's a commercial guy there. Yeah. He's going out kingfish fishing. Boy, this guy's pretty handy with that boat, yeah. isn't he? Yeah. Hey Bubba! What's going on, Mikey? Good morning, I'm Brian. Hey Brian. Stewart Live Bait. This is my son Michael here scooping up your bait for you. Hey Michael, how you doing today? What's up, fellas? How you doing today? <laughs> We're from Kansas. This is all new to us. Oh yeah. So this you is never, pretty exciting. They ain't never seen nothing like this. Oh, How much yeah. are you for them bikes over there? Good. Yeah. Okay. Sure. I don't want the black ball, ball my black ball. You gotta take the crappy fish. Oh, what are you talking about? Uh huh. <laughs> Did you bring my Spanish baits? No, sir. No, you didn't. I've been so busy saying my I'm sorry. <laughs> So how do you catch these bait? Uh, these, the pilchards are cast netted and our thread fins are speaky. Uh-huh. Yep. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. You got it with you? No, they're oh. not with me. Look at what they need. Put you together. So you think we're in good hands fishing with this cat? I think you'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. Yeah. You're a lot more confident than I am. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, gentlemen. I'll take you, dog. To me, Sam, it's so fun learning the aspects of fishing that you just don't even know about. Oh yeah, this is this is uh, world class fishing here, down here. You know, people yeah. come from all over the country to fish. Uh, you know, sailfish, mahi, uh, swordfish. I mean, you know, you can run 15 miles and be in the swordfish grounds, uh -huh. and we catch them up to 500 pounds. Wow. Wahoo, uh, blackfin tuna. It's is uh, the reason I came here 25 years ago. So, yeah, for that reason, for the fishing. All those along the bottom, huh, Sam? Yes, sir. That is fish. That is fish, buddy. There you go. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> well, that didn't take long. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> what do you got, Nate? You want to save some of these? Or? Dolphin right there. Look at that. Look. Oh, missed it. I want to see what kind of fish you got, Nate. Easy, and I don't reel him all the way up to the tip. You know that now. That's good enough. That's good enough. Work him up. Too much. See the bend in that rod? Yeah. The bend in that rod. Put your other hand up here. No, no, not that hand. The other one. Right. Okay, there you go. Hey! All right. Wow, alrighty. That's a Spanish mackerel. Spanish mackerel. Spanish mackerel. Boy, that right. didn't take too long. <laughs> Y'all want to save some of these? Or? Uh, what do you, what, how, where would we eat them at? How do we eat them? Well, you could cook them on the at river ponds or yeah. cook them in your oven. Yeah? What, you, what do you suggest? How would we cook that up? Just Well, uh, they're best broiled. Uh, Royals? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I like them on the grill. Well, it's a beautiful well, we, fish. We're going to chase some more, so let's just throw this one back. Okay, sounds good. Oh, too late, Nate. Oh. <laughs> I got it all on film. <laughs> this here. 
First cast. Wow, that's cool. Look at the bend in that rod. That's what you want. You gotta have a little bit of cushion. See, you bite them things off the butt of the rod. You don't, you don't raise it up. You just let them find. Look at that. Ooh, that's a nice one. Yep. Look at that. On that fin spin. What's wrong with that? No, no, no. What's wrong with that? Nothing. Kirby. Nothing wrong with that. Anything wrong with that? No. I love it. There it got him. There he oh. is. You got yours? Double. Come on. Double. This is Spanish mackerel fishing. Oh. These things are so good to eat. You know, a lot of people say, oh, I need a real stiff rod. I need a big, heavy rod. Well, I don't care what you got. You ain't going to be able to stop that thing. That's true. You'll just tear the hook out. See, that's a, that's a good edible Spanish right there. Nice and edible. Great table fare. Ain't no crap in spent pools like these things. No, 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 no. Now we were talking about why I come down here. There he is. You know, this, see that rod, bending that rod? That's the reason I came down here. Yeah. You know? It's addictive. <laughs> oh, it, it'll run you crazy. And I was lucky enough to have a good job with me coding hummingbird and they let me move down here and uh, I made it work you know I got it here you go buddy oh wow here here another nice damage show that to the cameras see he bit me then I want to show you. I want to show you the teeth. Ouchie! <laughs> Ow! See them teeth? That's where you can use 60 pound leader. 60 pound? 60 pound leader. And this is just the beginning of the fun. Yeah. As the summer goes on, man, we're going to have sailfish. We're going to have my my. We're going to have all the great species. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I guess Another pretty. one already? Yeah. Oh, I oh. could do this all day. <laughs> I think I got a bite. You got a bite? I thought I did. Come on. You should have. Yeah, I'm going to cast over here. Cast here we back. go. Great fish. Great fish. If I can say anything, they uh, kind of reel and pop it fast. All right. I'm going to change out. Yeah. Dad, come <laughs> on, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. You want to swap rock with your son? Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> no, you can't. You know what always happens? You don't want to. You know what always happens when me and Dad go fishing? He, Nate usually always catches the biggest. <laughs> and he always catches the most. So hopefully Give me a little slack line. Sorry about that. Wow, this is fun. This is, this is what saltwater, light tackle fishing is all about. Every cast. No That's wonder. The reason. So, how did you find out about this thing? I came down here in 1984 with a with a guy by the name of Mike Holiday. I got another. He was a lifeguard. Yeah. And. Uh, just a chance trip? No, I was working. He was a writer. Yeah. And I was working him. I was working for Minkota Hummingbird and Spiderwire. Yeah. And, uh, my 
Mike and I became good friends. He was long hair, kissy food. Sat on the beach. Hold on, hold on. 300 days a year. Sat on the beach, beach 300 days a year. Yeah. Watch this ocean. He learned so much about this ocean. Uh, he learned so much about watching this ocean. Yeah. 300 days a year. And I got to fishing with him. Enjoyed it so much down here. I said, you know what? I went through a divorce. Yeah. I said, I'm coming down here. And this is uh, this right here is the only reason Lisa married me. Yeah. <laughs> My wife of 20 years. One of these days, people gonna realize what an asset this ocean is. Yeah. And they're gonna quit polluting it. Uh huh. And they're gonna quit mistreating it. And it's gonna be there for everybody. But if we don't. We ain't gonna be there for nobody. You go to places like got a bite, come on, take China. it. China. When you get a bite, start reeling faster. All right. You go to places oh, like Oh wowzers. I think you just stole that from me. <laughs> oh, what was that? Oh, what is that? Oh, hey, what, what are you trying? What the heck? <laughs> I'll let a... you take it. We got a bird attack. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on to your rod. Right. I got okay. that, that's ours. That's a ganny. A ganny? Jeez <laughs> Louise, <laughs> Sam! Jackie's <It's> smacking <laughs> you. Thank God. I'm loose of my fish. <laughs> that you, thing is dedicated. You knocked the boat in gear. Oh, it did? Oh, crud. All right, sorry about that. <laughs> I've never oh, seen it. turn you loose if you just behave. <laughs> Unharmed. <laughs> a D hook. <laughs> get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was hilarious. I thought I had a seal. It came in like out of a nowhere. Seal? Yeah. I, I didn't know what that was. I'm like, I think I got a mackerel and then something else hit it. <laughs> I thought it came in at an angle. <laughs> Did you see that, Nate? What was that? Oh, what is What was that? Oh. Close, let me know when I'm ready. Nate's got one. Oh, wow. Oh, you got a. What is that? You got one. There you go. Oh, there's one on the crappy magnet. Like, that's what I thought. We just had to go a little bit more. A little bit. Good one. Look at old Nate. Wrap around your rod. Oh my gosh. There's a shark in the Crappy magnet. Shark just uh, almost tagged that. Really? Yeah. Where? I told you not to fall over. Oh, I'm not falling Look over. Look at there. On the crappie magnet. There's a shark. That's called the fin spin. Fin spin. By crappie magnet. Look at there. There's proof. There is proof right there, <laughs> buddy. Awesome. Oh. Fin Spin Pro. Awesome. Catch another one, two in a row. What do you think, man? I think you better. Just to prove our theory. If you want to stay on there, pro staff. Oh my gosh, there's a shark right here. Look, look. right there. Right there, you see? Oh, it's a massive shark. Oh my Bull god. Shark. Bull Where? shark. Yeah. Where? He uh, he was coming after that fish that was hitting my fin spin. I mean, it was massive. I'm gonna keep the camera facing this way just in case see it again. Dad. 
Reckon he'll put me on his pro staff? I bet he will. <laughs> I bet you can sell a lot of these in Florida. <laughs> you think he might? Hello. <laughs> wow. You think he might? Oh my goodness. Whoop. You think he might? I think he might. We're catching them every cast. Boy, he engulfed him. Thin Spin Pro. Mac. Catch another one. I want to get the zoom in function. Alright. Already got him? Yeah. Thin Spin? Thin Spin Pro, yeah. I don't know if this is a. Uh, this isn't what we've been catching. What is this? Yeah, it is. It is? Yeah. It's a little bigger. Don't, don't really get your drag pulling. Okay. Yeah. Now. Now wind. Yeah, that might be another shark. Got us on film, so bring up that shark. He's coming. Or else he's fooling me. Come on, Dad. Bring this home. Here, Nate, come over here. He's gonna come up over here. He's going by. Bite him in close. I didn't get the net. Sam. Get a big one? I'm I'm filming. Are Sam. Filming? Oh there's a shark! They chased it! I saw it! it? I think I got it on film. There's a did you get that shark? I think I did, yeah. Oh my god, there was It was a big old shark. Oh, good catch. Don't break that rod, hold it. No, <laughs> Okay, I got him in the middle of it. Oh my I, I, gosh, a huge shark came right by him when we landed yeah. it. We saw it. Oh my gosh, a huge shark. It's dad. Yeah. He almost skanked my shark. Whoa. Oh, that's a big one, Sam. Yeah, hey, get up there and get him, Nate. Get, get I'm some. gonna keep him. All right. For dinner. Smile. That's a good one here. Oh my gosh, the size of that shark was amazing. Here, Nate, get him. Nice! And guess what that was on? Fin spin. Okay, you ready? Hold on. Let's see, Nate, you need a net job? Oh, there's a shark. There's a shark chasing it. Oh god, I think the shark got it. Yeah, here. Shark. Oh, he came off. Good. Oh, oh, oh my that. Whoa, oh my Daddy God. Rabbit. He got it now. <laughs> Love God, tell me about that. <laughs> you don't think that bites you? <laughs> Big old red shark. Oh I don't think the camera got gosh. it though. No, I should have had the. Uh, I should have had the other camera going, but that's okay. That bite you? <laughs> Big old red shark. Oh I don't think the camera got gosh. it though. No, I should have had the. Uh, I should have had the other camera going, but that's okay. Wow, dude, give me five on that. Was that exciting? <laughs> yes. Yeah, the crap out of me. <laughs> shark bigger than the boat. Okay, hold on. Look at me. I'm gonna film some. Did you bite it off? Yeah. Oh yeah. That was a bull shark. Wow. And it is a man eater.
Bull shark will bite you. Have you ever got a bull shark on the line? Yeah, I've caught bull sharks. Really? Have you ever got one in the boat? Yeah. Sam Heaton, man, I cannot thank yeah. you enough. Trip of a lifetime for me and my son. <laughs> Old Nate did a good job. Catching well, fish from it, the first cast <laughs> on. <laughs> well, it's, a, it's gotten a little bit rough out here. And I think what we're going to do is run back, take a break, and then come back out this afternoon for a little while. Okay. See what we can do this afternoon. You know, this is a great resource out here if people would just not abuse it. You know, anytime we can come out here on the ocean in a 24 foot boat, catch fish that are delicious to eat. I kept two. Uh, I'm gonna have them for dinner tonight. And uh, you know, it's just a great resource. And I hope people, I hope people will take care of it more so than we have in the past. Absolutely. That's the biggest thing. You know, we've kind of always taken the oceans for granted. And I'm a member of a organization called captains for clean water and it's so important that we we do this so i had a great time today thank you it's a long way from kansas so. <laughs> oh my gosh it's so much success hey, so good job excited. buddy thank you so yeah. exciting we experienced uh birds attacking us sharks attacking <laughs> us and uh spanish yeah. mackerel attacking us and, we uh, caught man. them on doa we caught them on fence spin we caught them on uh Everything. Spoons, we caught them on, but we caught all of them on the Sam Heaton Super Salt, Super Salt. And man, what Sam a Sam Super Salt. What a great rod. Well, you know, I designed it for this, purposely I designed it for this type of fishing. You know, like I say, it's not going to work on a sailfish, but on Spanish, snook, trout, redfish, flounder. That's another fish that is one of my favorites to catch is flounder. But it's the wrong time of year for that. One piece, 100% graphite, incredible backbone, amazing tip. Like I could yeah. feel oh, when sure. I missed the, the bites. Yeah. I'm like, oh darn, I missed it. Yeah. But then I got yeah. it even more excited. Yeah. That's what you got to have. You got to have a sensitive tip. And then, you know, and then you got to have a backbone in the rod and you fight the, fight the fish off the handle of the rod. Don't fight him off the tip. If he gets to really pulling hard, Point the rod at him a little bit, take a little bit of that bend out of that rod, and then, then you get the opportunity. Don't ever get him up here like this. Okay. You know, get, keep him, keep him, keep your hands close to your body. Right. You know? When, you know, that's what they tell boxers. You know, keep your hands close to your body. Okay. So, and, and it'll work. Seven it'll work. foot, six inches. You know, that's my favorite size pole for walleye. Yeah, yeah. This Sam make a super heck of a... Well, you said you were going to set the world record on a walleye. Uh, I am. I'm going to take one of these from you, if you don't mind. Yeah, I got it. You got it, brother. You got it. B&M, Sam Super Salt with the uh, legendary crappie fisherman and now world-renowned <laughs> saltwater fisherman, Sam Heat. Thank you, guys. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see y'all next time. <laughs>
Thank you so much for watching Fish Eat Live. Our mission is to demonstrate the benefits of the Fish Eat Live lifestyle. We look forward to educating, entertaining, and attracting you to the healthy lifestyle of the great outdoors. We're definitely going to have some wholesome family fun on the water every Sunday at 6 p.m. So hit that subscription and that notification bell because we want you to come be a part of this.